Yo, what's good, y'all boys, man? It's Brock Sam back in another video with us today. And today, I'll be um doing a little updated video. You know what I'm saying? On this uh on this little the hood video right here that um you know what I'm saying did pretty good about nine months ago. And I was just going over the comments, and a lot of you guys were having trouble with it. So I'm gonna be updating the tutorial because there's a lot of stuff I didn't explain based on what I saw. And um yeah, but I would also like to give a shout out to my boy. You know what I'm saying, my boy Kenshi. You know what I'm saying. If y'all don't know him, you know him now. If I don't know him, you know, you know him what I'm now. saying. The Burgers and God, the one and only. Yes. The only reason why I'm giving him a shout out is because I was gonna actually delete that video, bro. And it actually did decent numbers, bro. Because it had like 20 views after like two days, bro. And he was like, bro, just keep it up there, bro. I was like, all right. And yeah, that's how that joint went. But um, yeah. So if you don't, bro, go ahead and subscribe to him, bro. Because I know y'all, y'all, I know, bro. Go ahead and subscribe to him. Let me go ahead and pull up his channel real quick. Where is it at? 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 Am I not sub? Am I not sub? Hold on. Hold on. Am I not subbed? Am I not subbed? Well, his, his YouTube channel is the bum kid. Wow. Wow. <laughs> chill, chill, chill. His username is, I do. I am subbed. I know I was subbed. His username is the bum kid. This is his YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Go ahead and subscribe to him. You know what I'm saying? He's going to be posting content soon. Trust in the process. Just trust in the process. But anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into this tutorial. Okay, y'all, so first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna type in Razor Synapse, because that's what you need. Let me start off by saying this, first of all. If you do not have a Razor mouse, this is not gonna work. This is not gonna work. So if you don't have a mouse that supports Razor, like, you know, it's like a Razor, Death Adder, Razor Viper Mini, you know what I'm saying? Like this, like, these type of mouses with the Razor logo on it, it will not work. You cannot use the macro, it just won't work. I'm sorry to tell you. But here, when you set up Razor Synapse, it's right here. You know what I'm saying? Click on that. Then you want to download here. Download it right here. For Windows 10 and 11, download it right here. And once you download it, um, once you download it, actually, let me go through the, I'm just going to briefly go through the whole process. You're going to download it here. Um, download the file, bro. So, yeah, once you go here, now you want to click on it. And then it should download. <clears throat> I don't know if y'all can see. I don't know if y'all can see it downloading. Hold well, on, let me just, um, let me just drag this way capture up so y'all can see the whole thing. Can y'all can y'all see this? Oh, can y'all see this? Oh, y'all yeah, can see this. I right, bet. So since y'all can see this, this is what you want to do. When you get to this part right here, you want to see the Razor Synapse. You want to download that and then show all apps. You want to scroll down. I mean, not show all. Show the modules right here. Once you click this right here, it's a little drop down. Go here, macro. Include that. Make sure it's checked on. Then you want to click install. <clears throat> so um, now we're gonna just wait for this to install. You know I'm saying, all right, y'all. Since the update is about to be, since the installation is about to be finished, once it is finished, you want to um, it's gonna say congratulations. Please sign in, raise their ID to get started. You know what I'm saying? Get started. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> then this should pop up right here. Raise the cortex, and now you're good. It's probably gonna tell you to log in with something, but yeah. You know what I'm saying? Pl total playtime, all this other stuff. So this is what you want to do from here. From here, you want to go to you want to go to huh, launcher huh, my library. Huh. I think it's huh, in game. Huh. Let me just click through. Let me just click through it all. Um, wait, where is it at? Hold on, I'll find it in a second. Okay, my bad. So apparently that was Razor Cortex that opened up. So this is Razor Synapse right here. As you can see, got my two my two Razor things and stuff like that. So what you want to do from here, dashboard. You want to scroll down to macro. So once you get here then you have this right here see i already have a macro but i'm gonna delete this and i'm going to redo it Fo follow these steps wisely very very wisely 
Okay, now that we're here, let's follow these wisely. You're gonna press record, and what you're gonna do is, once it records, you wanna, you're gonna press I, you're gonna hold I, then you're gonna press O. Then after that, after holding them both, you're gonna release I, you're gonna release the I button, and then you're gonna release O. And after that, you're gonna stop the recording. So then once you do that, you wanna go here, second delay, you wanna put on 0 0.01. Just like that, put all of these on 0 0.01. Like it's literally not that hard. I'm not gonna lie. So like I'm, I'm explaining this way, like like I'm doing it the best I can. 0.01. It's literally that simple. Then once you have that, now what you want to do is you want to add keybinds. So and then you want to click on your mouse. And what I use is I use mouse button four. It's a little side button on the side because it's very easy to use. So you click whatever bind, whatever button you want to use. I choose mouse button four. Then once you say it's played once, no, I play it until the while it's while it's pressed. So it will do it while it's, while I'm holding holding it down, so I can stop and go whenever I feel like it. Now you want to click save, and now that you click save to know that it's working, you can go in like any random text thing right here, any random text thing, and you can just hold it and it will type I O just like that. So now I'm about to show you guys how to actually macro in the hood. Now let me put y'all onto the main sauce right quick. So what you want to you want to have FPS unlocker. If you don't have FPS unlocker. You're not going to be in America because the higher the FPS, the faster your macro will go. So once you turn it on, um, if you don't have it, I'll put the link to it in the description. It's called Austin FPS Unlocker. And then you want to click this to download it. And then after that, you should just be able to run it. I'll put the link to that in the description. But anyway, after you do that, let's go ahead and get right into the game. Okay, so now I'm in the game, but I'm going to really put all y'all video users on the sauce. So the the more stretched your screen is, the higher FPS you're going to get. So I'm going to go ahead and go on this right here. 50, 50 by, uh, yeah. So I'm just going to do this. You know what I'm saying? If you haven't been yet, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I just put you on. Hold on, let me um, let me fix this right quick. Okay, so now that I fixed it, hold on, bro. Like, what is this kid doing, bro? Like, what is what is going on here, bro? I understand why they're killing me like this, but anyway, so now that you're here, you know what I'm saying? You want to put your go to your Roblox settings right here. Put the graphics quality to the lowest thing. I usually put it on two so I can see better, but one is also good. Helps help, helps helps your FPS. Then you want to go to the little settings tab. Where is it at? Update the game. And once you go here, you want to put on low GFX. Because if you don't, it would, you know what I'm saying? Fast macros, buddy, trust. You want it. You want the fast macros. You want the fast macros, bro, trust. If you don't have the fast macros, you won't be able to do it. But, um, hold on, give me a second, right quick. Okay, I'm back now. So, um, as you can see, my FPS is still pretty bad, but I don't know what's wrong with the game. I and mean, what's wrong with Roblox right now. But, like, that ain't got nothing to do with me, because I really don't care. I don't play this trash game anyway. But, anyway, it's probably because there's a lot of people in here. But, um, so now. Now that you have on low GFX and your graphics are low, you want to make sure you have animations and game pass. If you don't have this game pass, you can't do it, bro. I'm not gonna lie, it's a done data for you. Okay, so now that you're here, you got your little uh, game pass, I'm pretty sure, because you definitely need this. So then you want to hit greet when your head touches your head. When it literally touches your head, you see? Right here, you want to do, you want to equip and unequip. Bro, what is he doing? Get on somewhere. Move. M bro, oh my god, this kid is one of those. Hold on. Okay, now I'm back here. So when, the, like I said, when the hand hits your head, you want to equip and unequip something. Or if you already have it in your hand, like something like this, like a knife or something, you can just do that. Or if you have a knife, you can literally just equip it. But either way, when your head hits your head, when you, when your hand hits your head, that's what you do. And then after you do that, you want to hold S, and you want to start the macro like this. So your screen will do this, and you want to just zoom in, zoom all the way in as far as you can. So all you have to do when you walk back, when you walk back. You wanna, you wanna, you wanna hold S, and you wanna hold the macro button, and you wanna zoom all the way in. So that's all you gotta do. Listen, that's all you gotta do. And once you zoom in, you can hold the right mouse button because you don't, don't go in shift lock because you can't do it in shift. You have to be out of shift lock. And to control it, you wanna hold the right click on your on your mouse button. You wanna just look left and right. So what I do is, I literally like if I'm trying to slow down, I either hold the side button, like hold either D or A to slow down. Then when I'm going, when I wanna go faster, just go straight. I just full send it, hold S. You have to keep holding S too. You have to keep holding S. Why is your macro? Right? So that's really all you have to do. And yeah, you know what I'm saying. And um, I think the back. I don't know how. I don't know how backward, backwards macro line works, but I just know that like you lay on the floor, do this, and then you just do the same process. You should be able to backwards. I don't think Razor doesn't have the best backwards macro. I'm not gonna lie. But forwards, you want to greet, equipped, unequipped, or you can just equipped. Raise your head, and you want to just go. That's really all you got to do. It's that simple. It's that easy, literally. It's that easy. It's that easy. Can't be in shift block, none of that. That's all you. That's all you got to do. Literally, that's all you got to do. I'm gonna do it one more time. Do it one more time for people that didn't pay attention. 
greet, equipped, unequipped, or you can greet. So you just drop your head, equipped, unequipped, or you can just equipped, and then you can just go. It's really that simple. That's all you gotta do. Literally, that's all you gotta do. And now you can macro. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, that's all you gotta do. That's really all you have to do. You know what I'm saying? You go pretty fast. You know what I'm saying? What I do to make the game look faster, I type slash FOV uh, 110, I think that's the command. Okay, no, I don't think that's it. Hold on. I think it's slash, oh, slash E. Slash E FOV uh, 110, I think. I think, I don't know. Hold on, let me figure it out. Actually, I'd like to change FOV right here. I put on 110 usually, and I click change. And then when you do it, it, look, it, makes like, it looks like you are faster. So you greet, you click unequipped, and you want to go. It makes you look like it's going faster. And yeah. It's gonna take it's gonna take you a minute to get control of your macro. As you can see, I'm not really good at controlling it because I don't I really don't play this game. But anyway, that's besides the point. But yep. So now you know how to macro with Razor side naps. It's really not hard. All you gotta do is follow the instructions, follow the steps. If you have to go back in the video at a certain time, just go ahead and do that. And um yeah, you will never see me make any more hood videos. By the way, I'm really only did this just because like y'all had a lot of questions on it. I didn't want to just leave y'all stranded. You know what I'm saying? But W man. But um. Yeah, though, if you, um, if you liked the video, if you enjoyed this, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on the post notifications so you know time to post a video. If you enjoyed this, link in the description, you know what I'm saying? I stream anime games, you know what I'm saying? That's really my content, you know what I'm saying? I don't really post stuff like this. I just posted this because I was going to post the hood, but then I realized I didn't want to. The game is actually, but, anyway, I'll catch y'all boys in the next one. Peace.